So, this is the final video and it's going to show you how to use your timer to get the game to end. So we've got a bit of a challenge in our game. Now you will already have had to make the timer and this is the script here. So if you haven't done that you'll need to watch that video on how to make a timer. And what we're going to do now is use that timer to make the game end. And I'm on the stage here and that's where the script will go. So I'm just going to make a new backdrop now so that when the game ends. So the quickest way to do it is just to duplicate the existing one and what I'm going to do is just add some text on top. Click here and I will say game over and then if people want to play again we need to tell them how so I'm just going to press that and say press space to play again. Okay, so let's just move this around a little bit. I'll put it there and maybe we'll have the text in white so it stands out a little bit more. So there we go, that's our backdrop. So what we want to do now is get the script. So what we're going to do is when the time gets to zero we want the game to end. So just like before we're going to get the when space is clicked and as usual we're going to use forever because we want to keep checking forever and again like before we're using the if. Now you can see for the score when we said if score is greater than high score for the timer we're going to see if the time is less than one as in zero we want the game to end so what I'm going to do is use the operators this time drop it into there go to the data and you can see there's my time left so if time left is less than one I want it to change to the different backdrop so that game over backdrop is called backdrop three so I go to looks and I'm going to switch to backdrop three now the problem with this is the game's not going to end and it also means when we restart the game it won't disappear. Let me show you what I mean. So you can see it's it's not switching back. Okay. So what I need to do is at the start of the game when somebody presses space I need to switch to the original backdrop which is backdrop 2. So I'll try it now. That's fine. And when it gets to zero it will switch to this one. But the game won't end because we haven't told it to. So all I need to do is go into control and choose stop all. Now to show you this working I'm just going to change the timer to five seconds so we can see it and here we go so it's five, four, three, two, one, game over. Press space to play again and it restarts look and that's how we get the game to end using a timer and to make the game more challenging.